it's it's what we want, it's what we need, it's what we're going to have. And we're going to keep this car. An elderly couple living out their final days at the Holiday Park Resort in Lake Country have been in a battle with ICBC since September after their van was sideswiped by a truck. According to ICBC, the damage to the van far outweighs the cost to repair it. But owner of the van, Gord McInnes, says he's unwilling to part with what he expects to be his family's last vehicle. All we want is the, the bills paid that we put out of, out of pocket money on. We're not asking for the, the car to be uh, replaced. All we are wanting is the car to be repaired. Unhappy with the price point from ICBC, the owner of the vehicle decided to get another estimate from a shop in Lake Country. I got another estimate from a non a non ICBC shop and it was about half the price and I'll go out to pick a part and pick up these two doors and then have them installed. However, ICBC won't do that. They won't use a pick apart parts. After Castanet reached out to ICBC for comment, McKinnis says the insurance company got back to him and signed off on the repairs. ICBC, however, said in a statement they had been in talks with the other registered owner of the van and had approved the repairs of the van days prior to Castanet's questions. He's going to go along with me keeping the car and uh, they'll look after the expenses for the doors and getting the car back to order again. Uh, I'm delighted to know that they're going to let me keep the car. ICBC tells Cassinet that once the vehicle is repaired, they'll have to check it and make sure it's safe to operate on the road before paying back the cash value of the vehicle. I'm Braden Ursel in Lake Country for Castanet.